Maxim has been living in Slovakia for the second year. He came here from Russia to study. He says that when a full-scale war started in Ukraine, he realized that it was unlikely he would return home. The young specialist prefers living in a country where he can freely express his opinion. I'm almost 25. I can think with my head. I can analyze different sources. But why can't other people do the same? Everyone has to think with his head. Everyone has to understand what is going on. Sergei, together with his wife, also emigrated to Slovakia before the war started in Ukraine. Now he understands that taking a one-way ticket was the right decision. We came here for a reason. We have lost everything in Russia, both business and work. According to the Federal State Statistics Service, 18,000 residents left Moscow from January to May. Among them are many Russian show business representatives who have definitely spoken out against the war. Russia is to blame for so many terrible sins, and yet it says it is not to blame. The atrocities in Bucha were not our fault. The Malaysian bombing was not our fault. Mariupol was raised to the ground was not our fault. Maxim Galkin, Alla Pugachova, Alexei Panin, Andrei Makarevich, Chulpan Hamatova. This is just a small list of Russian elite who left the country. Since the period when Russia started the war against Ukraine on February 24th, almost 4 million people have left the Russian Federation, according to the Federal Security Service. Kazakhstan, Georgia and Armenia are most often chosen by Russians to emigrate. These countries have already felt the influx of Russian migrants. Since March 2022, a lot of clients from Russia have come to us. There are also from Belarus and Ukraine, but most of the flow was from Russia. They started renting apartments and prices went up. Sociologists are now predicting a second wave of migration. Businessmen, scientists and IT specialists are planning to leave Russia, more than 2 million in total. Russians have begun to emigrate even from the central, most prosperous regions of the country. The reasons are loss of jobs, inflation and decline of the solvency of the population. Young people are also fleeing from possible mobilization into the Russian army. But according to analysts, mostly those who have the means to do so are leaving. Affluent individuals have been emigrating from Russia in steadily rising numbers every year over the past decade. An early warning sign of the current problems the country is facing. Historically, major country collapses have usually been predecessed by an acceleration in the immigration of wealthy people, who are often the first to leave as they have the means to do so. Andrew M. Oils, head of research at New World Wells. London-based migration consulting company predicts that 15,000 millionaires and their families will leave Russia by the end of 2022. As a result, the current migration outflow experienced by Russia can cause the country even more damage than Western sanctions. Reported by Marina Stepanenko, Natalia Husak, UATV News.